It's me, Serena. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So glad to have you with me here today. I have an awesome Amazon haul for you guys today featuring the brand Kate Casson. Kate Casson reached out to me and asked if I would be so kind as to do a video featuring their products. And of course I said yes, uh, because they have beautiful items, lots of dresses, lots of sweaters, blouses, skirts, really a little bit of everything. Since we're going into fall time, I featured sweaters and even a coat in this haul. Plus, I do have one gorgeous cocktail dress to share with you. It's just a perfect dress to keep in your closet for whenever you need a little black dress to put on to go to a wedding, a cocktail party, any kind of event. It's just one of those dresses you could keep forever. So if that sounds good to you, just stick around and keep watching. So Kate Casson features all kinds of clothing from the very casual to the very dressy. And even within their sweaters, there's a huge variety, a variety in colors, a variety in styles, and variety when it comes to, you know, how thick or thin it is or just what season you wear it in. But all the items that you see today, I'm wearing in a size small everything and also I went a little crazy with this color <laughs> with the camel color um, but these come in a wide variety of colors so don't think that just because I'm showing you lots of shades of tan and camel that they don't come in other colors because they do okay so this first sweater is this white pointail knit sweater with a knit collar. And in case you didn't know, these sweaters with collars are very popular this year. It's a very trendy thing. It's carrying right along with that preppy theme that we're seeing this fall also. So this is just a really lightweight knit. This is something you can wear really, you know, three seasons out of the year. It's perfect for the beginning of fall is perfect for spring and you could layer it up under something else in winter but it does have this open stitch design running through it and a nice v-neck with the knit collar and I'm just wearing it here with uh, some straight leg jeans from Old Navy these are the OG straight jeans and also wearing these Steve Madden suede booties. I got these last year during the Nordstrom sale, uh, but they have a very similar pair this year. I'll be sure to link all these items from Kate Casson, as well as what I'm styling each piece with in the description box down below. Another big trend we're seeing this year with sweaters is the quarter zip sweater, like I'm wearing here. And this one, as you'll see off to the side here, I styled with those same jeans, but I swapped out the boots for something a little more casual, and I put it with these suede Chelsea boots. And this sweater is really nice because it is slightly oversized, even though this is a small, um, so keep that in mind of the fit. It's this great shaker knit, just a medium weight sweater shaker knit, but then the sleeves have this cable knit design, so you got a little interest there. And then, of course, the neck can zip all the way up, <laughs> and you can fold it over into a turtleneck. So if it's really cold and you need to keep your neck warm, you can zip it up and do that. The rest of the time, you know, you can just leave it unzipped and open or zip it, you know, to your level of comfort. And then the collar just spreads out nice and wide like this. So you could layer this over a t-shirt or tank top or just wear it by itself. And this sweater, on me anyway, is long enough that if you uncuff it, I kind of had it cuffed up under itself with the jeans. But if you unroll that cuff and pull it down, it comes down past my hips. So I could wear this sweater with leggings. As a matter of fact, as I sit here filming, I've got it on with leggings right now. So you most certainly can do that, at least if you're on the petite side. This sweater, as are all these, is just really silky soft. They're made out of polyester, viscose, and maybe a little spandex. So there's no acrylic, nothing itchy about them. Just really nice, soft, silky, comfortable sweaters. 
Okay, in this next look, we've got a different sweater, and in this color, I'm not calling it camel, I'm calling this pumpkin. <laughs> to me, this is kind of the color of pumpkin pie. I'm not sure if it's coming across that way on camera, but in real life, that is what this color reminds me of. So it's deeper than a camel color. But it's got this gorgeous wide band around the bottom that's rib knit, and then the rest of the sweater is this pretty cable knit. And now it does have a snap right here at the neck for modesty, so because this is just a surplus sweater, and the snap keeps it closed. However, I feel like, at least on me, this sweater looks better unsnapped. And yes, it is rather low cut when I unsnap it, but I think for this particular sweater, I'm going to wear some sort of cami underneath it, and I'm going to remove that little snap and just wear it more open like this, because I feel like where that snap is, it's almost too high, or it is, I feel like it's too high, and so it pulls a little bit, and you can kind of see the snap. I like it better just open, so that is my plan for this sweater, is to wear it that way. And I'm wearing this sweater with my new favorite pair of jeans that I'm going to feature in another video. But these are from Target. And these are the kick crop flare or crop boot cut. I forget the exact name. I'll have them linked down below. But I just love this silhouette of jean. It's just so easy to wear and it looks good with any shoes you put with them. And uh, I thought the color of these jeans looked really nice with this particular sweater. And I'm wearing those same Steve Madden booties again. Hey, are you enjoying this video? If so, be sure to give me a thumbs up and let me know that you'd like to see more videos just like this one. Okay, next up, switching it up a little bit to a blouse. And I thought this blouse was just absolutely gorgeous. And it's in this white, it's just a pullover blouse with a ruffle down the front, and then the, the sleeves are lace. And it's just kind of an open, lacy sleeve, and then it's got that same lace detail going right down the middle. So this is a blouse that you could really wear any time of year, even in the summer when it's hot, because it's got these lacy sleeves and I just love it. Here I've got it paired with these coated denim pants. These are by Cut From The Cloth. I got these last year, but these have been so super popular that they're back, and um, I will be sure to link these down below. These are just such uh, an interesting and different kind of pant. It gives you that leather look, but it doesn't feel like leather or even faux leather. It's just a coated denim. But the blouse, I thought, was a nice juxtaposition against the more edgy pants with this pretty feminine lacy blouse. And with this look, I'm just wearing some strappy sandals. And, of course, you could wear booties, flats, whatever, but I thought that you could just really dress this up and wear this out to dinner, out, you know, for a night out. Depending on the jewelry and accessories you put with it, you could really dress this up. You could wear this blouse with a skirt, with dress slacks for work, wear it under a blazer. Would be great in a professional setting. So just a really, really versatile blouse. And another great item that I received from Kate Casson is this gorgeous trench coat. You can't go wrong with a classic camel colored trench coat. And this one is so nice. This is not um, like a cottony raincoat trench. This is thicker. It's more like an overcoat, but it's not a super heavy overcoat. Honestly, this is the kind of coat that I would be just fine with for most of the winter here where I live in Alabama. It rarely gets cold enough to need like a really big heavy coat. It will a few times a year, but most of the time a coat just like this is perfect for our weather. And the nice thing about this one is it does come with a tie sash, it has pockets, and it's fully lined. So it's easy to slip on over those sweaters or whatever you happen to be wearing because it does have the nice silky lining all the way down the arms and throughout the body of the coat. So this was just a really great surprise 
I wasn't sure how I would like this coat, but turns out it's just perfect, and I'm wearing this also in a size small. So this would be a great coat for you guys to pick up for the coming winter season. This next look is a little more casual. I'm wearing a waffle knit tee from Walmart along with some black leggings and sneakers with this camel colored cardigan. This is more of what I would call a lightweight cardigan. It, the stitching, it's almost kind of a waffle texture, I guess I would call it, maybe not quite, but it's kind of an open stitch, so it's not a really heavy, thick cardigan. It's something for early fall. You can just throw this on with jeans, with a t-shirt, with really anything, and I feel like that hood keeps it casual, so that's why I thought to put this together with some leggings and sneakers and just keep it, you know, a very casual outfit. This is just a great layering piece to throw on and go in those on those cool mornings, maybe when you need something when you're taking the kids to school or running your errands and then you can ditch it later in the day if it warms up. But this is just a great cozy little cardigan to pull on when you need that layering piece. And this color, of course it comes in many colors, but this camel color will go with absolutely anything. It will look great with jeans. Of course it looks great with black. Just a super versatile casual piece. Now this next look is something a little bit out of the box. <laughs> I saw this and it was just so interesting that I had to have it. So I am anxious to hear what you think about it. Please give me some comments, some feedback, and please give me some feedback on all the items that I've shared. Let me know your favorite and um, what you thought about the way I styled each piece. But this item, this is kind of a cross between a sweater and a poncho. It's just really unique. So this sweater has fitted sleeves down at the bottom, but the body of the sweater is very loose and oversized. But then it kind of comes up in the middle and the front and in the back. And it's put together in a really interesting way. It's made of this rib knit sweater material and it's sewn together in pieces of the ribs like going different directions. I don't know if that's coming across on camera, but it just gives a lot of interest to this sweater. And it just has a little mock neck up top, so nothing. T it's not tight at all. It's very easy to pull on over your head, and it's not very high either, which I appreciate with my short neck. Um, but this is just so cozy and so unique. And with something this big and oversized, you really want to go fitted on the bottom so you don't end up looking frumpy. So I put this with my Spanx faux leather leggings. If you like faux leather, I will also uh, link the ones from Walmart down below. Those are much more budget friendly. But I just like the look of this sweater with the faux leather leggings. And then I've got on a pair of Western inspired boots also from Walmart that I'll be sure to link down below. But this is just so interesting. And if you're not into leggings, um, that's fine too. You could wear this with some skinny jeans, some skinny black jeans, anything like that. I would just keep your pants very fitted. So that you don't look frumpy or sloppy with something loose on the bottom and loose on the top. You want to always balance out those two. So let me know what you think about this sweater. I think it's really neat. I plan on taking this and the leggings to our trip on New York or our trip to New York. I think this sweater is just really unique and different. All right, next up is the dress that I promised you. So not only does Kate Casson have tons of sweaters and blouses, skirts, jackets, coats, they have gorgeous dresses. And I picked this one up in black. This is just a classic, you know, party or cocktail dress that everybody needs to have in their closet because you never know when you're going to need something just like this. This one has the pretty kind of halter design around the neck and then comes in, you know, shows off your shoulders really nicely. The top 
bodice portion of this dress has a lace overlay. Not sure if that's coming across on camera on the footage, but it is lacy at the top. And then at the bottom, it's just a stretchy jersey kind of fabric. The nice thing about this dress is it does have this wrap or kind of, I guess you call that a tulip hem where it kind of wraps across and the hem curves up at the bottom. And then one side wraps around the front and it has these gathers in it. So this does wonders to conceal a tummy. So if your tummy is your area of concern, <laughs> like it is on me, then this dress is super forgiving and flattering because it has that gathering, that kind of ruching that drapes across the front and it camouflages a tummy really, really well. But this dress is very comfortable. It is stretchy. It has a zipper all the way up the back, so it's very easy to get into. And this does come in other colors. I just chose black because black is a classic and you always need that little black dress. But you could wear this to a wedding. You could wear it to a cocktail party, a holiday party really all kinds of occasions this dress would lend itself to and i'm wearing it in a size small and it fits me just right thanks again to kate casson for sponsoring this video and i hope you all enjoyed all the items that i've shown you today i will have everything linked in the description down below for easy shopping and until i see you in my next video have a stylish day bye bye